What up, people? This is Ron again, and I just took my NCLEX. Yes, I just took it. Um, Monday, I did a 75 question exam, and I just got completely tired. I didn't feel like doing anything else. I was just like, I can't do this right now. So, I was just like, and then that's when I received my ATT. I was just like, I need to take this week. I'm just going to take it. Jesus, take the wheel. I'm going to take it gonna do my best and I studied to the best of my abilities so that's what I did I scheduled it for today at 8 a.m. and I ironically took it at the same time and day of the week like I did the last one I was really worried about that but I was just like fuck it I need to take this bitch so sorry for me cussing but I had to take it. I just need to get it out the way. Not get it out the way, but I was just like, I know this week is the time that I needed to take it. So I did 75 questions on Monday and then I reviewed my answers. And then I Tuesday, I was talking to my friend. She was like, don't do, wake up kind of early. Don't do anything after 12 p.m. Didn't do anything but before uh and after 12 so i was looking at like the hearse review strategies and like some of my own tips for myself and like just a few concept things that i wanted to get over i mean to review so that's what i did and i was just like all right 12 p.m i didn't do anything i was like i went for a walk afterwards and then um bought some lavender oil and uh because like lavender oil helps with anxiety and stress so I was just like all right use it tonight put some on my wrist and also on my temples and uh, then Tuesday night I prayed on it I was just like Jesus help me make it through this exam help me the help me pass the exam with how much work that I put in how much time I spent reviewing the content and trying to understand the material to provide safe and efficient care to my future patients. And I just asked the Lord for his grace and guidance for uh, me to pass this exam. So I took a melatonin around seven because I haven't been sleeping that well for the past few weeks. So I was just like, all right, I, I should probably take something to help me. So I took it around 7, thinking I was going to fall asleep at 9.30. <laughs> no, that did not happen. I got in bed around 9.30. And from like 9.30 to 2.30, I don't know if I was asleep or not. Because I was reviewing content in my head. Like, I was just reviewing stuff. I know my eyes was closed, but I, I just can't say if I was asleep or not. So I woke up around, or got out of bed around 11.30. And I was just like, all right, so this is not okay. So I'm like listening to music and then that was like a good hour. And then I drank some milk, some uh, warmed up milk and drank it. So I did that and I was just like, all right, I can't sleep in my bed right now. So make me a nice little pallet on the floor. And I didn't go to sleep for another two hours. Couldn't go to sleep for another two hours. So I was just like, what the heck is going on? So I think I went to sleep officially around three and I woke up at five. So I did not get any sleep <laughs> when I was like for my NCLEX. And I was a little bit worried about that, but I was just like, when I was laying down, like I am ready for this. No NCLEX formed against me shall prosper. I am ready to pass this. I am ready to get out of limbo. I am ready to start becoming a nurse. I worked so hard to this to get to this point that I am ready. I am ready for this. I am ready to start helping people and I'm ready to like do something that I want in an environment that I need to be in. So I was just like, that was just going through my head and then I fell asleep and then I woke up like probably two hours after that. And I had my mom make sure to check on me because I was just like, all right, can you please just make sure I'm up around this time? And I was up. So then my friend dropped me off. Godson. I love Jasmine so much. She's one of my closest friends from nursing school. And I 
she picked me up and I made sure to eat like breakfast. I took like a whole bunch of crap load of vitamins. I was taking Optimind with Optimind, I think it's called. And it normally helps with like memory and stuff like that. So I was taking that throughout my studying and I took like two this morning because I was just like, all right, I need something to keep my brain active since I didn't get much, that much sleep. Also took a vitamin D and B12 vitamin and that ended up helping me. So I did that, eat breakfast, and then make sure I had all my stuff. And then my friend pulled up. I was just like, I'm ready. And we went to the Pearson View Testing Center. I also had to take a Xanax because I get really bad testing anxiety. And I was just like, I was confident in myself, but I just needed something extra to help me. So when that happened, I was pretty cool. I was like doing breathing exercises before the testing started. And I end up being able to get accommodations. I was able to test in a room by myself, which was good. And got that done. I was taking an exam and I was just like, all right, carefully taking my time, thinking through the questions, rationalizing the answers. And I was just like, all right, I just noticed that I was getting close to 75. I'm like, all right, if I have to take it past 75, so be it. So I'm just going to take a break then. And then it cut off at 75 questions. And I was just like, I didn't feel bad about it. I was like, I did the best that I could. I put in the time. And I was just like, I feel good about it. And I called my friend and she picked me up and we was talking about it. I didn't get no calculation questions, which was a blessing. I got a whole bunch of select all that apply. And I'm like, I will see on Friday what I got. And I'll let y'all know. This is going to be a combined video. So, whew, we'll see. God's grace with me. Florence Nightingale blessing. Lord help me. And um, I'll keep you updated. Thanks. Hey guys, so I just found out that I am officially Ronald Harris, BSN RN, and it feels great. Like, I took my NCLEX yesterday, or being Wednesday, and it's, it's, it's amazing. I feel great about it. Oh my god, it's just such a relief. Like, I was on 10, I drank me like a half a bottle of wine, even though that's not good, considering the time frame that I drank it, but... I had to celebrate somehow. It, it's so great. Like, I'm a nurse. I can help people now. I have the, I proved to NCLEX that I can make it despite what was against me at the time or I just, I am so happy. I am proud of this moment. It's, this is like coming above me graduating right now. Like, I went through so much to get this far and like I said I failed the first time and now I passed and that doesn't matter if you failed don't worry about it you can get through it I, I I'm just mind blown like I was looking on my email and I got the oops I got the notification from Oregon like oh let me show y'all like I am oh I just I am just mind blown like, I, I I just don't know. Like, let me show y'all. Mm. This is the notification that I got. You probably can't see it and it's probably in reverse, but yes, I got this from Oregon today. And I took my exam yesterday. I was expecting to find out tomorrow. But I found out today and it's freaking great. Like, it's such a great feeling. Like, I made it this far to become a nurse and I can finally start my life. I'm not in this limbo state anymore. And it's just, it's great. Oh my God. I'm just, I'm a nurse. I am a nurse. I, I can help people. I am, I can start being an adult and move out my parents' place soon. And I just apply for a few jobs too in Oregon. And I'm just like, yes. Like, I'm registered in Oregon, and nothing's stopping me from leaving. Like, oh my god, I just need someone to contact me soon, and I'm going to keep y'all updated, but 
I can move. I can get the heck up out of here. I, oh my God, my facial mus muscles right now is just starting to like hurt because I've been smiling like probably for three hours, not mm, three hours roughly. Oh my God. I am just, oh, it's such a blessing. Like I am a nurse and I was just like checking multiple sources. Thank you, Jesus. Oh my God. I, thank you, Lord. Like I just, I, I, I feel great about this. Like I can start living my life and helping people. I am sorry this is like repetitive, but I am just amazed right now. I am, you can do it. You can make it. If you strive hard you and grind, you can do it no matter what. I failed one class in nursing school. I failed the NCLEX the first time and now I'm a registered nurse. That doesn't mean anything. You can do it too. Oh my God. <laughs> Just keep hope alive. During NCLEX, I suggest, like studying for NCLEX, I suggest Hearst. Hearst is a great resource and use something that has like another question bank and 